this episode of Sailing Daydream, we had the pleasure of Andrew's gorgeous daughter Sky joining us aboard and sailing with us back from Sydney to Pitwater. Sky and Andrew have a great relationship and it was so lovely getting to share this experience with her. She's full of beans and recently returned from backpacking in Canada and Asia. A talented photographer and sharp as a tack, she's one of my all-time favourite people in the whole world. Okay, so we're getting ready to go, ready for, yeah. for their sail. Say hi guys. Hi. Hi. Put the sail up there. Miss Lacey Dog's got her life jacket on. Hi Lacey. Beautiful day. How are you feeling Nicola? Good. Yeah? A little bit um, apprehensive because we've got the wind looking up if we take too long to get out the heads today. Yeah. But um, I think we're good. I think we'll be alright. I think we'll be alright. How are you feeling Dad? Good, good. Yeah. Ready to go? Ready to go? Yep. Yep. They're mentally prepared? <laughs> yeah, yeah. As much as possible. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's do it. Yeah. Lacey. Lacey. Hello. Hi. They're just approaching up on some of the friendly ocean creatures. Dolphins. Dolphins. <gasps> Are they going to come in the bow of the boat? Oh! Woohoo! Where'd they go? Oh! Woohoo! Oh! How cool was that? Woohoo! That was so much fun! <laughs> that was awesome! Is that our first dolphin right on the bow? Yeah, first time. First time. You lost your bow virginity. Lost the what? Bow virginity. That doesn't sound great, does it? You can cut that. Cut. sailed into the wind on our trip back to Pitwater, which makes the boat heel or lean over very steeply. where she got her sense of humour from. Had a nap, Sky and Andrew headed out for in the tender to go fishing, but they stumbled on a pot of dolphins feeding instead. Wow. Oh my god! Yay, smile! <laughs> oh, 
Ah, the joys of being on the water. <laughs> we dropped Skye back to the airport and can't wait for her next visit. What are we eating, Andrew? Oh, lamb shanks from the pressure cooker. Woohoo! Woo are they nice? Bloody good. Great. Yeah. And what are we watching? Seinfeld. As usual. As usual. <laughs> no TV. No TV. No CD. Or DVD nowadays, isn't it? That's right. Watching the old pee. <laughs> <laughs> Picking up a quilt that Nicola put on the bow lifelines to dry it, to air out, and it's blowing off. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> oh, look at that, it's almost dry. Well, Save the pegs, that was the main <laughs> thing. The pegs. They're quite expensive pegs. <laughs> That's only wet on the top. Yeah. Just having my morning coffee up on the front deck and it's absolutely beautiful morning. Uh, birds are chirping, the sun's out, there's not very much wind but it might pick up a bit later on and I just had to show you these beautiful rocks behind the boat. Can you see them over between me and the boat there? They're just lovely, lovely backyard to come up, wake up to in the morning. So today we've got my dad on board the boat and I asked him how long are you staying and he said well sweetheart he said I've got till Friday and this was on Sunday <laughs> so I said I told Andrew I thought you might want to move aboard if you could and um, so he's here for a few more nights and we're going to spend the day hopefully going and finding some wind so we can go for a sail today. Where are we off to today sweetheart? Uh, we're going to sail past Cottage Point in What's the national park's name? <laughs> Kuringai Chase, Chase National Park. Chase National Park. New South Wales. New, New South Sydney. Wales. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're going to go up Smith's Creek, which is, we've been there once and it's an amazing place. Mm, yeah. mm. Not over. Well, I saw the winds moving around so much. <laughs> well, careful you again. We're tricky in here. Very tricky in here. So what are you what are you working on over there, Trevor? A telltale. We Tell need a telltale so we can see where the wind's coming from and the very light breezes. And so the idea is to unravel this and then have a thin string of it and we'll be able to see which way the wind's coming. Very good. Because we didn't have any little nice bits of ribbon or anything. No, we didn't have any ribbon, we didn't have any wool. <laughs> so <laughs> we're undoing this. I've got all day to do it, so it's fine. That's your I've only got three days to do it. It's your only task. <laughs> <laughs> it's my only task for the next three days. <laughs> <laughs> I actually hadn't had a relationship with my dad for the past 17 years, but he became a patron of our videos and we reconnected. I can't begin to express how wonderful it's been to have him back in my life. We're very similar in lots of ways and we were very close when I was growing up. It's been one of the most healing, cherished experiences that I've ever had, sharing my life with him again. He loved sailing and having him on board was so special and so much fun. So how's the peanut ham soup been guys? Oh, beautiful, thank you. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> Can't talk. Can't talk. <laughs> on to your second serves. Mm. Yeah. That's good. Thanks, Nicola. You're welcome. You're a good cook. Thanks, darling. Look at that. Oh, look at that for a telltale. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Gotta love it when a plane comes <laughs> 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 right. You were so patient making those. <laughs> Thank 
girl. So this is our new hull cleaning technique with my dad holding onto the ropes, keeping the tender in close. <laughs> and Andrew's using a broom to get off some of the stuff on the hull. And you may ask why he's not just jumping in. And it's because it's bloody freezing. <laughs> <laughs> so we're trying to minimise time in the water. Yeah, we don't get all of it, still helps a bit, doesn't it? it certainly oh, yeah, does, Dan. Yeah, we're yes. looking for wind. Looking for wind. No wind. Sails are laughing. No good. I got this picture in my closet. It's gathering dust right now. And the edges have been folded once or twice. Doesn't look the same no more Cause the sun has made it pale I used to have it hanging on my wall some time ago <laughs> Hello lovely, come and play Hey! <laughs> Aren't you lovely? Hello, I'm the boat. Oh wow! <laughs> Hello gorgeous ones! Hello. Hello. Come and play with us. <laughs> oh, and you're off. <laughs> oh, aren't they lovely? Yeah, I like it. See the dolphin, Lacey? wind today and my dad and Andrew are putting in the first reef in the sail so we can test it out, hey babe? Yeah, strong enough wind to do Putting a reef in the sail means you don't have to hoist the entire sail, giving you more control in strong winds. That's a cute sail. having no wind one day to close to gale force winds the next. The joys of sailing. So we just had 30 knot gusts which is the most that we've had under sail and it was Pretty exciting but it didn't feel too scary because we've got the new main sheet set up and uh, anyway we've dropped the sails and we've just come in here to get a cappuccino and a coffee and an iced chocolate from Cottage Point as a reward. How good is this? Isn't it beautiful? Mm. 